All right, so Gilbert Arenas called out Team USA this week, and there's a couple things here. Um, They're uh, competing in the 2023 FIBA Basketball World Cup in Indonesia. Uh, Gilbert didn't like the roster. He said, quote, you see what Steve Kerr got? A sorry-ass group. Some of them probably don't even start for their own team. But I, I just think, you know, this, this, is, this is weird. My wife brought me, you know, she, she, she put this on my, my radar. She brought this to my attention because he also said something about me this week. And you go through these periods where I think guys are just pissed off at the world for whatever it may be. And I think Gilbert at this point is just trying to get, you know, clicks. And my, my wife wanted me to respond to him, what he said about what me. What did he say about you? Yeah, it is. You know, you know when he came out and he was talking about whose career we talked about this. Who career would you rather oh, have? Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. James Harden to mine, and he went on to say, "I didn't even read it. I told my wife I didn't want to hear it because you know I don't argue with idiots because you know the person on the outside don't know who the idiot is. So through these periods where I think guys are just pissed off at the world for whatever it may be, he used the angry black man tactic." <laughs> I'm angry because I took 300 million over seven rings in 56. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry, Bob. <laughs> I'm sorry, Bob. Now you're going to repeat something that probably I didn't actually say. Because, you know, I don't argue with idiots oh. because, you know, the person on the outside don't know who the idiot is. So I um, I just, I don't want to hear it. And she was like, he said this, you should respond. I'm like, I give a two shits what he said about me. But <laughs> it said something that I was basically a guy. Ooh, he used the word basically, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> which means ah, it's not actually, it's not accurate. <laughs> basically, like basically not a real fact. You know, like somebody said, how'd you do? Uh, uh, you know, I, you know, that kind of, basically it was, you know what I mean? You start using shit like that. So obviously he's already lying. Guy who just, you know, wrote coattails of every team I was on to well, win that's bullshit. Thank you, white man. That's bullshit. He knows I didn't say that. <laughs> See, he got called out by his own host. That's bullshit. Thank you, white man. Let's, let's hear him say it Guy who just you know wrote coattails of every team I was on to well, win that's bullshit. That's bullshit. I did not say this. I did not say he was hanging on other people's coattails. Like he's projecting. You're projecting, Bob. <laughs> Bob, big shot, Bob. I mean, that could be great basketball name or sh- like straight porn title. Big shot, Bob does it again. <laughs> no, seriously. I'm not even going to mention the fact that he called me an idiot. Gilbert Arenas is on one this month, so he's in, he's asking he's multiple torn times. I am. I'm, I'm. He's right. I'm on one. I'm on fire, <laughs> right? I'm like burning. My shit is gold. My shit is on fire right now, right? I'm up in the do. I got ESP. I got the herd. I got the. I got everybody hitting me. Can I use your take? Can I use your take? I'm sorry. I'm getting to the stories, Bob. I'm sorry, my man. I will teach you this. I will teach you this. You know this trick of mine. You know, but you know, you got to wait to turn. Whatever the hot topic is, he has something to say negative about it. He's trying to become the villain or something. I don't know what he's doing. You know, I have no beef with him. What do you mean villain? What do you mean negative take? <laughs> it's a, it's the same thing you're doing. You're it's a sports show, right? You got a sports podcast, right? Then you're you know, so if you have a topic, you're going to be on one side or the other, right? That's it, right? You know, you you. Dwayne Wade, you know, I've seen some of your takes. Dwayne Wade or, you know, Paul Pierce. I, I guess the one you say is better than the other one. The other one's going to say, oh, that's a negative take. You the villain, I guess. I hope Agent Arnold has the best ever. I hope he gets into the Hall of Fame. I hope he have, he wins a championship. I hope all these things. <laughs> no. See, my black man, you, you see what kind of sly shit he do? But he know damn well I can't win no championship. God damn it, I'm 41. <laughs> I'm old as fuck. I'm, I'm with you, man. We retire. We, I've never seen a retired man win a championship from his motherfucking couch, Bob. Okay? God, you ain't going to win eight from that room right there. Just like I'm not going to win one. We both know neither one of us is getting, <laughs> getting in the Hall of Fame. I actually have a better chance than you. <laughs> with a subscriber count of 2,000 people. His seven rings got him a cool 2,000. <laughs> you know what, speaking of that, I'm gonna give you a shout out, Bob, just so you can see how it works. I want everybody to subscribe to 
Big Shot Bob podcast. You know, if you want to see what a seven-time NBA champion looks like, I need y'all to go subscribe to Big Shot Bob. Let him know who sent you. <laughs> the dude, the idiot. Right? But that, that that's you know right now. You can't do nothing with those rings when you retire. You're meaningless. That's all I was saying. I'd rather take the 300 million because that 300 million can get me to do other things. Them seven rings just sitting somewhere and behind Bob with the smiley afro. Who the fuck knows? I don't, I, I don't feel disrespected. You know, this is, it's for me, I say, okay, this is coming from a guy who, you know, who's, he's mad at the world. Yeah. He didn't win a championship. You know, he's, he's never, he's never done anything but score a lot of points. You know, he wasn't a defensive player, you know. Bonafide like, player though. I'm, I'm mad at the world because I scored a lot of points and got a lot of money. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I, <laughs> I don't know how that math worked in your brain before you said it, but I scored a lot of points, made a lot of money. Three-time All-Star, three-time All-NBA player, the cover of video games, got my own shoe line, just dropped again, got my own shows. What would I be mad at again, Bob? I was an NBA champ. I didn't get a chance to get that. Um, I was, you know, I was a fan favorite. You know, my shoes was second behind Tracy McGrady. You know, Tracy McGrady. Um, it was in front of Tim Duncan's, who was a five-time champ. It was in front of, you know, Kevin Garnett, um, who was a champ too. So, you know, um, I was popular. I mean, if I can, I can sponsor. The big box. I mean, you're gonna have to get your numbers up. I mean, <laughs> two thousand subs for a seven-time NBA champion is ridiculously bad. <laughs> I'm just saying that you look like you belong in the YouTube beef sector <laughs> with those type of numbers, Bob. Gilbert Arena's been on a roll lately. He's getting on everybody. He's trying to check everybody. In those clips that y'all seen, he's reacting to Robert Ory on his Big Shot podcast, talking about how he was just a mediocre player, basically. Yeah, writing coattails of other other franchises that he was on, etc. and all that. Uh, the Houston Rockets, the Lakers, the Spurs. The dude got seven championships. So Gilbert Arenas is just reacting to what he was saying. And basically Gil is saying, dude, you're lying. I didn't even say what you talking about. So he's just clearing up the air. And I'm with Gil on the Hall of Fame part. Both of them are not going to make the Hall of Fame. Both of them are not going to make the Hall of Fame. Gil has no rings and Robert Horry has seven, but he wasn't the star on any of those teams. And he didn't make an all NBA. He didn't make the all star game. He didn't do none of that. He didn't. He don't have no individual award, no accolades, nothing. All he has is those seven rings. So I agree that he won't make the Hall of Fame, even though I feel like he deserves to be in it. But just because you deserve to be in the Hall of Fame don't mean realistically you'll be in the Hall of Fame. And then here goes Gil trying to bring up the money talking about he got more money than Bob and all that. He's more popular and all that. So basically, they're just going back and forth, man. Gil's been on a roll trying to check everybody. But man, this is this is comedy right here. And Robert Horry did say he'll pull up to the Gills Arena so they could talk about this. But yeah, we're going to have to see, man. I just wanted y'all to check that out, man. Gills been on the road, like I said. I appreciate y'all and I love y'all, man. Road to 3K. We almost there. Let's get it, man. Peace and love, family.